Ladies and gentlemen, for the last time, welcome and enjoy. The film is about uh, food, but it's also about emotions, and it, it's also about how people would react to the food, which is, in the end, is the most important thing because you can eat just to satisfy yourself, <laughs> or you can eat to just in order to get some emotions and to get some emotions back. <laughs> She's a writer and she has just written a, a hit. You know, she said the peak of her professional success and everybody's expecting a second bestseller. So she's experiencing that anxiety of not really knowing, did I do that? How can I do that again? Ella ha citat un llibre, és molt interessant. Gràcies, moltes gràcies. Però hauria de ser jo la que està encantada d'estar aquí, eh? I ho estic, vull dir que, esclat. So it's definitely a very crucial moment in her life. She's trying to find herself, trying to make sense of life. What is it that makes you feel complete? Bé, m'agradaria que aquesta nit ens deixés a tots amb la sensació de que hem tancat 15 anys de feina, però amb un somriure. Tasting menu in itself, it's, it's a character of the film. But I think they all get there with their frustrations and their mixed emotions and they end up living using the food as a, as a catharsis. Getting a TV on the last night is almost impossible. Is that what I think it is? He wouldn't want to miss this. In, in a way, it's a melting pot. I mean, it's a lot of people from all over the world that get together for one night just to be there and, and eat together. It's not only the food, it's what surrounds the food. It's the environment, the company of the person you're with, taking the time to just appreciate what you've got right in front of you. You know, there's nothing more precious than freedom. If you can be free with somebody by your side. L'important, encara que sembli impossible, és que quan s'ajunten les dues emocions és com funciona.